Shantir Weems did not speak during her court hearing today, but once the proceedings were over, her defense attorney had plenty to say. This case has resonated. It resonates across all races and sexes. Defense attorney Tony Garcia exited D.C. Superior Court Tuesday morning with some of the family members of 50-year-old Shantir Weems who were among a contingent of supporters in the gallery for the hearing. Ms. Weems um, appreciates the support that she's getting. I believe there is there are many things that divide this country, but the protection of our children is not one of them. She's currently charged with shooting her husband, James Weems Jr., on July 21st in room 823 of the Mandarin Oriental Hotel in Southwest D.C. over allegations that he sexually abused children attending her Baltimore County daycare. I will not get into specifics, but I will say she will aid in the protection of any of the alleged children under her care. Period. According to court filings, Ms. Weems told police, quote, she didn't want to kill him. She just wanted to hurt him, but said she does want to kill herself. She wants him to be held accountable. She wants him to never molest another child. And when confronted with that information, um, you know, he charged her and she defended herself. Weems will be indicted, likely before Halloween, according to Garcia. They're still interviewing witnesses. He says, we're still in the discovery process and says he's also anticipating delivery of DNA evidence. Shantir Weems remains behind bars tonight. She's being held at the D.C. jail on a no bond status. Her next court appearance has been scheduled, though, for November 28th. And today the judge set a trial date, December 6th. In Washington, I'm Kate Amara, WBAL TV 11 News.